when you run out of building materials, find some ducks. Hey everybody, Coach Scott here again to help you with another instant challenge. Today we're going to help you with quacky structure. Make sure you click subscribe down below if you want to see future challenges. For this challenge, we have to build a freestanding structure which includes as many of these ducts as possible. We'll build this using four pipe cleaners, four paper clips, 12 inch length of string, four mailing labels, four twist ties, two rubber bands, two cocktail umbrellas, and four straws. The rules of the challenge state that the mailing labels may not be attached to the table or the ducks, and the ducks may not touch the table or each other. Let's get started. Okay, first thing we need to do is figure out what's going to be the base of our structure. We need something that can stand. Luckily, we have these two umbrellas. They don't stand up like this, but cocktail umbrella, if you push it in right here, push it all the way through, look what it does. It creates a nice standing structure. Flip it around. Look at that. We've got two legs for that, right? Okay. So if our structure, we're gonna have it like so. We have to keep Thinking about these ducks, continually think about how are we going to get these ducks attached to our structure without breaking the rules. Well, I have an idea for this. First, let's take our rubber band and let's wrap it around duck number one. Nice and tight. All right, now, oops, that's not tight enough. Nice and tight. Now. If we were to take that and just stab it right through there, look at that. Duck number one, attached to our structure, and he is not touching the table. Very good. Let's do the same thing for this side. Let's take this duck, wrap a rubber band around him a couple times, make sure it's tight. And then we just stab this one right through there. Okay, very good. All right, we have a start. We have a foundation. Okay, now I need to build these things up. I think I'm gonna do that with the straws. So I need to attach the straws to the umbrella. Let's use mailing label. Now remember, I said before, you don't have to use the whole mailing label actually tear it in half. So if I want to attach this straw down to here, put one half, make sure you do not attach this sticker to the duck, otherwise you break the rules. Okay, there, so it's not attached to the duck. And let's tap the other half to make it nice and secure. So we have our first leg. Now we do the same thing with a second. Move that guy out of the way so you can see what I'm doing here. All right, so we're gonna do that with our second straw. This time we're gonna start with the top guy. We're gonna put that right there. Put the straw up against it and wrap it around. Nice and secure. And that way, we can secure the second one. Be super careful not to attach it to the duck. Perfect. All right. So now that is not a structure yet. They're not connected. Here I'm going to show you a trick. Anytime you have a challenge where you're using paper clips and a straw. There's a way, if you take this paper clip, like so, and you just pull it up like that, you can actually 
insert it into the straw, and it becomes a connector. Like so. Look at that. And you can bend it down to make it more even. Okay, and so now if we want to do another one on that side. We take the same thing, we bend the paper clip to make a 90 degree angle. See how I did that? Okay. Stick one end into here to that straw, and the other end to this straw. Now look at that. We've got a structure. All right, we can stop there and we have two ducks, but I think we can do more. Let's first make this a little more stable. What if I put a post right here? That might make it stable, but this post has no feet. You want feet on the post. So another trick, you can do with your paper clips is do the exact same thing. Make them into 90 degree angles. Okay. Post it so. That's one. But that doesn't stop it from falling this way. So if we take that second one, do the exact same thing. Put that one in here. Look at that. Now we have feet for our post. If you want to make it more stable, fold those feet out a little bit. So that now it stands up nice and solid. So what we're going to do now, we're going to take this and we need to attach it to that guy. Let us do that with a mailing label. So take your mailing label, just keep it whole this time. Stick it about right in the middle spot. Okay. Take your post. Make sure they're touching. Bring it down and wrap it together. Like so. Okay. Now you've got a post. So what can we do with this post? I say, let's attach some ducks. These ducks need a safety harness. So we're gonna, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a pipe cleaner, fold it in half, put a twisty tie right in the middle, and just twist the pipe cleaner a couple times, just to be secure, okay? Now we want to put our harness onto our duck. So let's just wrap it around his neck, like so. Well, this might be Wonder Woman duck, so it might be her neck. Twist it a few times. Voila. Now you've got a harness. Now, take this to your structure, and you twist it up just a couple times you let it hang, look at that. You now have three ducks. If you repeat that process, you might be able to get a fourth duck. Okay, we're gonna put the pipe cleaner through the middle. Might be hard to see with the black on black, I apologize for that. But I'm twisting two together. And then we're going to put this harness on this duck. Okay, and then we're going to twist it around a few times. And now let's attach him to our structure. All right, we want to adjust our feet to make sure it's balanced. Okay. Now, can we get the last guy on there? I think we can. Let's create another harness. So 
So in case you weren't able to see what I was doing there because of the black on black here. Doing here, putting it right in the middle, and I'm twisting it around just a couple times. So it looks like that. And at that point, I'm wrapping the harness around his neck so he's nice and safe. Now this guy, I'm not going to have hang. This guy, we're going to try to have him sit on top of our structure. So to do that, let's sit him on our structure, right on that post, and wrap this end around, like so. Wrap this end around. This is where that post comes in handy because we need some support. Look at that. We've got one, two, three, four, five ducks. Well, that's it for today's challenge. Hopefully you learned a tip or two today. But remember, just because I did it this way doesn't mean you have to. The key is to use your imagination, your creativity to do things your way. In doing that, you're sure to crash through all challenges and obstacles that come to you in life. In the description below, you'll find the rules and details of this challenge in case you want to try it for yourself. Make sure you subscribe to this channel and click that notification bell so you'll be notified when the next challenge gets posted.